loosely designed to have variable gameplay, so it would not get boring. Mm -hmm. The design choices, it was really smartly made. It was a good game by critical standards. It's just not that fun <laughs> now. Dude, like, it's we still made pretty level. fucking fun. We made every single level completely different. I was like, well, that's a shame, because some of the levels are really fun, and other ones are... Are we going to start? Dude, I'm starting. I'm going to include that little Half-Life to raid. <laughs> it was pretty good. That was, that was insightful. Should, yeah. we, should we say welcome, or do we even care? Welcome back to Extra Lives. I hope you enjoyed our little spiel about things. I'm going to shine my sword. About Half-Life. I still love Half-Life with all my heart and being. I still oh, love oh. Half-Life, too. It's the plot twist inside. The <laughs> no, that's not actually a plot the twist. Call, the call is coming from inside the temple. What if the temple is a colossus? It's too small to be one of the colossi. Oh, God, that's terrifying. <laughs> like the last Oh, this colossi. one's nice, dude. This one's big. Oh, uh, yeah, this one's, a, this one's a really good one. I'm nice. kind of excited. Oh, Column of Light! Can't go wrong with the Column of Light. Everybody knows that's yeah, where the fight far. is. Yeah, you don't, go, you don't go to the Column of Light. You don't go to the Column of Light. But it, this one's far. But this that one's much. far, and you gotta be afraid yeah. to. Actually, you want me to go to this one? And you're getting. Uh, yeah, balls. Okay, stepping away for a bit. All right. Hello. So now we are Shadow of the Colossus playthrough uh, minus sorry, one. Never mind. They had the wrong number. Have a good night. Does this happen in the last two playthroughs I've done with you? Really? Yeah. I just have a, I have a really common number, but I think I touched upon that in Banjo Tooie. Yeah, because that happened during Banjo Tooie. Whoopie Doodles. Come on, horse. Whoopie Doodles. God, New from Whoopi Goldberg. Goldberg. <laughs> Whoopie Doodles. They taste like Whoopie. <laughs> in yeah. breakfast cereal form. It's like the strange. I'm Whoopie. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Sister Act. Everyone liked that movie. <laughs> Dude, I watched The View one time. Yeah. Oh my god. It, it was five minutes of her talking about her cat. And I was like, she's making more money than me right now. And she's talking about her cat. Oh, it was sad. Yeah, I talk about my cat for free. Seriously. Gosh, so and I dress him up in all these little outfits. I'm Whoopi. Oh, shut your mouth. <laughs> Have you guys seen the Tim and Eric sketch uh, called Whoopsie Daisy? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's It revolves around this Whoopi Goldberg impersonator just playing pranks on people. Whoopsie! Spaghetti. Spaghetti. One thing you can always count on me to be really, really excited about is just weird sketch comedy shows like Tim and Eric. See, if you kill that, that little... Wait, how do I get off? Whew. I'm whoopsie. I'll put a link to I'm Whoopsie right here and here. If you read the wiki, you would know that this little black thing that looks like a glitch is a lizard. And if you kill them, your grip gauge increases or something like yeah, that. Yeah, actually, actually. Oh, wait, no, you pick up the tail and your grip gauge. But what, though? Are you yeah. kidding me? Your grip gauge increases. You can't even see how much it increases. But where the hell did you go? Ah. Uh. Oh, 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 oh. I actually figured that out when I played it. Oh. But I never actually picked him up, I just slaughtered him. No, that's what <laughs> I, I did. left him there. That's what I did too, because I noticed they'd, they'd like. Yeah. I'd be like trying to save at some temples and stuff. There'd be and, lizards. Like, there'd just be lizards crawling around, and I'd be like, oh my god, what are these inky monstrosities? And I'd stomp them out. And I'd yeah, be like, why so, is this tail sitting there? Yeah. So, viewers, if you just like kill them and walk by, I still, I still got an increase in grip gauge. So maybe I'm just an idiot. There's or also white that. lizards that increase your health. Once, like you don't need these to beat the game at all. They're just there. I think you can curb some of them. I don't think get this. <clears throat> no. Yeah. They look like shadows. I know they don't look like real things. I didn't know they were real things until a while back. Huh? All right, Shadow of the Colossus. If you want to do that, I guess you can. Shut up. Eh. This game is artsy as fuck, though. Jesus fucking Christ. You haven't even... Once you get to the, the like, ending sequence, the, the other cutscene, you're like, oh my god. And then if you've played Ico, you're like, oh my god! There's a lot of really subtle Ico references in we here. We should do a Dear Esther playthrough. 
because that game is shit. <laughs> Dear Esther is just the artsiest thing you can ever play. It's not as much a game as an immersive narrative experience where you walk around an island and there's someone who's talking to you. Yeah, which is really well written. Oh, Moz, could you turn off the lights again? Ah, uh, yeah. Dude, sure. I was actually thinking about doing a Banjo Kazooie nuts and bolts playthrough. <laughs> that that would I've, be like the I've new considered it. Sonic 06. That's what I was thinking! Fuck you, John, for leaving Game Grumps! <laughs> I don't, don't Ah, <laughs> Michael fell. We don't mean Downside that, Downside about John. it. Funny story, if you turn you. off lights, you can't see where you're walking. Is that how that works? Alright, launch me, horse! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, I landed on the horse. Dun, da, da, dun, 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 So if you read the wiki, you know that... Oh, fuck, how do you dive? That this that, is the deepest ocean in the history of man. No, if you read the wiki, you know there's a slight movement speed, speed increase if you use your hands instead of the sword or bow, and if you swim underwater. Yeah, a lot of people I know, and by that I mean two people I know that I've tried to make play this game, cannot make this one jump. That isn't particularly hard, which means I've probably just jinxed myself. Let me try. We'll all try it. We'll do it yeah. one you at all, a time. And this will be the whole episode. Because I've, I've, I've never done this in more than three tries. Just jumping to that ledge. Danny, you're up. All right. So uh, L1 grip. R1 to grip. R1 grip. Try Good thing I ask jump. that. Hey, hey, you did it first try. Chris, this is Hold there. on to R1. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Wait, how, what was the, uh, what was it? Hold down triangle. That's what it was. And then let go of triangle? No, I think, I think you got it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> nice. All right, now it's all the you. Wait, 3D platform. Head up there. No, because I'm used I to... I thought you wanted to try this, Colossus. No, 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 you still get to do it. This is just one of my favorites. All right. This one, I, I, I just, I love the puzzle. Great, There's a great. little jump. There's a little jump. Like, over, over Oh, yonder. you know I'm going to fuck this up. If you just made that last jump and you fail here, I'm gonna be so happy. Heard it! <laughs> oh, I grabbed the ledge. Lovely. Yeah, this Colossus is one of my favorites. I like the little puzzle involved. I like everything. Okay, good thing I can see. Uh, I say, there's a staircase oh, there. Um, oh, oh, okay. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a little bit of a shindig going on. Oh, wow! This is very good looking. Right back at you, bud. It's just big, and it's got it's got a big, long, hard sword. And, uh, I thought you were gonna say penis. Like, like on first glance, you're like, oh, I can just climb up his legs like the first one, but then you can't, cause he's got little stumpy legs. Oh, he looks like a gearman. Oh, okay. He's got a really cool puzzle. Oh. oh, okay. So what do I do? I just homing attack his back. See, if I get if I get hit by that, I'm pretty much smushed. Okay, so you can't climb up his legs. No, cause they're little balls. They're balls. How could he walk on balls? Oh, it's the sword. He's like the he's like the power of this. Okay, that makes sense. It's gotta be the ball. I mean the sword. Keep running, and the base keeps running, 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 running. Oh. And then you're like, oh, oh. his sword gets stuck in the ground, so okay. I must be able to climb up his sword. But then there's something blocking it. Ugh. And then you grab onto that. And then that works. Yeah. <laughs> and then you don't do anything because you're retarded and don't know that jumping is how you get up to the top of the Colossus. I'm gonna put that 50% on you, Marth. 50% on me. No, it's not actually what you do, though. Oh, really? Yeah. It's a real... Ah! Uh, the boss is so cool. There's some mechanic he does that almost works, so there must be something more. Ah, it's so brilliant! I don't know what you mean, but hey, I'm gonna experience it on my own lonesome. Do not! I like how this guy is literally so big that oh, you can't even oh. see him. All right, balls. I would like to see. He's a not the biggest, bit. but he's big. Oh, Lordy! Great. Great. <gasps> what are you gonna do, huh, pussy? Okay. 
What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> okay, cool, you're back. And you let's hold do this. L1 to lock on to remember. Right, right. Good lord! He's, He's a big so boy. Big. He's very That's big. That's what she said? Who is she? I would like to meet her. Hey man, you have a girlfriend. Back off. She's mine. I meant for casual conversation. Oh. Well, uh, she's really interesting and witty. That's why she says all those things that are kind of funny and sexual. Because she's flirty. But not too flirty that she's slutty. Oh. Like a kind of hot girl who's, you know, hot enough that she doesn't get hit on all the time. But she's, you know, good for conversation. But if you get to know her, you'll see her inner beauty by Martin Lawrence. <laughs> That's great! <laughs> I love Martin Lawrence. You're gonna get wrecked if you stand still. <laughs> Fuck that. Come at me, pussy. <laughs> Come at me, pussy. <laughs> Beep boop. Beep boop. Empire! Empire! <laughs> Swat alarm! Seriously, how do I get him to do anything that isn't just plunge sword vertically towards the edge of the platform? Because I'm running out of platform. Well, it's a shame it's all soft grass. Yes, you've noticed that the Colossi has something that might work, but there must be something more. And if it's not on him, and it's not on you, it must integrate the environment. That was your hint. Oh, he hasn't gotten, he hasn't gotten any of the cryptic dormant hints yet. If yeah. you take long enough to figure him out, the demon from the beginning of the game will just like hit you up and be like, you're dumb. Get up on his back. And give you, but more cryptically, like, Dost thou know what a wiener's dog might shed on the fur of his tail? Okay, so how do I do this, I guess, is my next question. I don't know. That looks kind of different. Perhaps we'll find out next time on Extra Lives. <laughs>